Hi, it's Steve Maxwell here, and I'm going to talk to you about vapor retarders, also called vapor barriers. It's usually a kind of polyethylene plastic that's applied to the inside face, the warm face, of stud frame walls. To understand why a vapor retarder is necessary, take a look at this cross-section of a wall. That's the inside and outside surfaces with insulation between. In this example, the left side is the cold outside area, as if it was winter, and the inside is heated space. If that warm air is allowed to make its way into the wall cavity, as it will if the vapor barrier is not there, droplets of condensation are going to form somewhere within that wall cavity. And that's a bad thing because the moisture is going to trigger mold growth and poor indoor air quality, and that's bad. That's why vapor retarders are applied to the warm side of a wall like this. When it's in place, that warm air cannot make its way into the wall cavity. That wall cavity stays dry, which is exactly what you want. This is my favorite vapor retarder. It's actually very smart in the way that it operates. Once again, take a look at this wall cross section. With this product applied, if there ever does happen to be high moisture buildup inside the wall, it has the capacity to let that moisture dry. It actually goes through this particular poly. When the internal wall cavity humidity is low, it acts as a conventional vapor barrier to stop more moisture moving in. The product is called Membrane, spelled kind of differently. That's the latest and best on the market right now.